we are in Fukuoka. We'll get to that reason after. We, because Fukuoka is known for their ramen, and everything looks like Ichiro. It's thin hakatame. Remember I always talk about that one place where you have like your own little section and you eat ramen by yourself? Anyways, that originated in Fukuoka. So that's why all the ramen looks like Ichiran. Yeah, they all look like Ichiran style. It's like thin, um, firm noodles. Pork broth. And we have all this to pick from. Ichiran is our favorite ramen. And it, they all look like Ichiran. Yeah. It's like heaven. Net. Anyways, Hi. um... I can't really think, I'm so hungry. Okay. <laughs> but we're here for another bar. As you guys see in the thumbnail. Let's go. Oh no. It looks freaking packed. Everyone wants to eat now, man. Oh my god. That's terrible. It's too much evil. Look at this place. It's all ramen shop. Every single restaurant is completely packed. Those lines are way too long, so. We are gonna try and find another spot. But this is Fukuoka. This is kind of more south right now, right? Mm. Like a couple hours south of Osaka. Mm. Looks like Tokyo though. Doesn't look much different. But apparently, people are a bit different here. This is Kyushu, Kyushu region. region. Yeah. So it's a lot different than Kanto, where you're from. Yeah. Way a lot different. different. And I'm pretty sure they're a lot different compared to Kansai as well. Yeah. Do they speak a different dialect? Yes, they do. Really? Hakata Ben. Hakata? Hakata Ben. <laughs> uh -huh. That's cool. Anyways, we're going to be here for a couple days. We'll see what we get into. Well, we're next in line. The line is still huge. We've been waiting for like 30 minutes. Excited? I'm excited. Babe, it's too bright. <laughs> Was it worth the wait though? Yes, totally worth it. Well, I won't know until I eat it, but I really want that foamy broth. That was worth 30 minutes. I think so. For next, so. might be another 10 minutes. Imagine, imagine if it just sucks. <laughs> It'd be way better for the vlog if it just let us down. <laughs> <laughs> We're in here, baby. Let's go. I'm so excited. Alright. You want this one? Yeah, I want that one. Yawa, yeah, well, which is soft. No, I regular. want extra hard. Extra hard. Extra hard noodles. Yeah. That's the secret, guys. Do you want negi and the kikurage? Yes, I want everything. Okay. Give me the works. And there you go, boys. The famous ramen of Fukuoka. It looks fire. We got gyoza coming too. So normally, it's way better if it's spicy ramen, but. They have a spicy menteko ramen, and I don't want that. What Freaking is it? So eh? I'm just Josh! <laughs> oh my gosh! It's really good. I normally don't eat regular ramen. It has to be spicy, but this one gets a pass. Karikata. It's friggin' Ichiro. Yeah? It's Ichiro. Yeah. It's good. It's really good. Time to make it spicy. It's way better for spicy. Okay. Are you loving it? I'm, I'm loving it. 10 out of 10? 10. 10 out. This is the best ramen I've had in Japan. Best ramen. You hear that, guys? Yeah. Huge statement. This is not the best ramen I've ever had in Japan. <laughs> oh, really? Your childhood ramen is my favorite by far. Mmm. -hmm. Okay. That's so sweet. <laughs> no, legit. It's my favorite. Goes the time. Good night. Oh, yeah. It's good. I like the yeah bite size goes up. Look at the egg. Chashu test. I actually prefer the thin chashu. chashu. It's so good. Yeah. I think perfect. me too. I like the thin chashu. Perfect, perfect. Everywhere perfect. else is pretty thick. It's thick. This is the way to do it. Good work. Oh, freaking fool. That was fire. Now to the good part. Alright, we're taking the bullet train. It's that train that goes 200 miles an hour. It's about an hour and a half journey to get to this place where we need to go pick up a new bus. Well, just got word that we're only on here for 15 minutes. That sucks. And then we gotta hop on the local train. Looks like it's in fast forward, but it's not. Doing her makeup in the 
bathroom. I got my bathroom here with a window. I think the guy's picking us up at the train station, which is a pretty random guy you get off the internet. Luckily, we're in the van, so weird stuff doesn't happen that often. Hopefully, <laughs> we'll be there soon. And we're off. That does look different out here, no? No, it's the same. Nice. We found our train. Look, it's only two cars. It's so tiny. I got the stand-up noodle shop. Standing up noodle. That's cool. We're on the train. <laughs> that train is only two cars. Yeah. It's such a like antique train too. It's interesting. A train with two cars. Can yeah, I've know? never seen such things. I feel like we're on a Disney ride. I feel like I'm on an adventure. On an adventure? Like this feels like we're traveling a country that we've never been to. Right? Yeah. We're going to get you a new car. How does that feel? I just hope it's all good and no problems because the price that we found it for Way too good it's to way too good to be true. Yeah, so that's the whole reason why we came to Fukuoka is because we found this car for the uh, Yahoo Auctions. Sight unseen. We told the guy, we come check the car out before we pay. It's only right. So that's what we're doing now. That's why we're here. Checking out a car we've never seen before and hoping that it's, that it's, that it's good. That it's good. Yeah, it's, it's just way too good to be true. But he's meeting us at the train station, he's picking us up, and we're just riding with strangers. I love that. Oh my gosh, we made it. Wrong way. We're gonna go this way. I have no idea. This is the train we just took. How small they are. What did we get ourselves into? <laughs> Maybe it would suck to travel 14 hours away and have this guy like not show like, up. I know he hasn't responded to me. I'm kind of nervous. I'm worried. Walk across the train tracks. That's pretty cool. Made it. Made it safe <laughs> so country. So quiet. quiet. So where we come from, they have machines here. They just trust you to put your ticket in. Alright, interesting. And look, there's a little machine that you purchase your ticket from. He's in the RSA net. I knew it. Think so? It's him. It's gotta be him. There it is, boys. Yeah. He is making a deal, but we just went and looked over the whole car. She good. You don't even want to know how cheap this thing is. Insane. But I think it's because everything's pink, but you know what? It's a girl's car, so that's okay. The whole freaking car is pink. We got another S15, the one that Leah's always wanted, but this thing is in a non-turbo. Probably slap a turbo on there in the future, but it's got some good stuff. Brand new DMX coils, Nismo clusters. Everything has like 40,000 original miles. Nice little exhaust. We got DMX arms and links. Got a diff in here. Full arrow, LED tails. She good. We're gonna get out of here so I can make a proper video of this thing, but I gotta raise it because it's going on the ferry. It's pretty low right now. And then we can head out of here. Well, we're in a classroom now. Ah, oh, what happened? You wanna give a brief breakdown? Of I don't know what happened. Why are we back at the station? Where's the S15? The freaking banks are closed and we weren't able to send money to the guy's bank. We went to the Komini and tried to take out from the ATM. Wouldn't let us take out from the ATM. So we told the guy, here, take a thousand bucks and hold the car for us. But he's like, don't worry about it. When the bank's open, we'll go ahead and send him the cash and schedule a transport to pick up the car from his house and then to the ferry and then to home, which I wanted to vlog all that because it would have been sick, but things happen. Luckily, the guy's nice enough. He's gonna raise the car for us and have that thing shipped to us, but kind of a fail, not really. Um, we have freaking pink S15. I was, I don't know how I feel about the Lambo doors. I didn't even tell him about that. You just ruined it. Anyways, we'll throw in the picture right here. I didn't want to show you guys. I wanted it to be like a funny joke for Leah getting out of the car. <laughs> 
I don't know why she's not, so embarrassed I'm, about the Lambo I'm very doors. I'm embarrassed about them. Dude, the Lambo doors are sick. It would be sick if I was a sick drifter, but I'm not. So <laughs> I just look like a poser at this point. But, but tell them the funny part. <laughs> Only the left side works. <laughs> <laughs> the right side is just a regular door. Good though, because you get in and out from the. Yeah. So I'll be the guy getting the out of the person passenger that's being seat. Being embarrassed is the person in the passenger seat. I freaking <laughs> love Lambo doors. <laughs> that was supposed to be a surprise. Oh. But anyways, we ruined that. You guys see that Lambo doors? It's freaking sick. Anyways, what are we doing? If you can see, there's only one train per hour. That's the kind of place we're in right now, so... Mind you, we've been sitting here for 30 minutes yeah, already waiting for this do. train. <laughs> there she is! Her train. How random is this freaking classroom, though? Well, after a long journey, three hours later, we are back in Fukuoka City. They still have Christmas lights! I guess we're gonna check into a hotel. Yeah. So I guess the plan is to leave here first thing in the morning. 7 o'clock a.m. So we're not gonna do much here. Probably get some food, walk around the city a little bit, but we're so exhausted. Guys, check out this hotel that we are not staying at. <laughs> we need to save money. It's a balance, guys. Balance. We bought two cars in one week. You gotta go with the cheaper hotel. But honestly, this hotel is not bad. We've stayed at a lot of Oppo hotels, and I recommend if you are just going there to sleep. Because they're everywhere in Japan. Yeah. So. Oppo Hotel is yeah. the jam. 70 bucks for two people. We're about to check out the room. It's pretty nice. It makes you feel like you spent money, you know? And here it is. A fancy little jail cell. <laughs> it's small. It's okay. Tiny. We're only here to Yeah. We're literally leaving at six o'clock in the morning, so we're only here for like seven hours or something, so who cares? But yeah, that's what you get for 70 bucks. Not bad, guys. Are we really going out right now? I'm hungry. I want to eat dinner. I'm hungry. Oh. Sorry, guys, this vlog just consisted of a lot of train ride B-roll and airplane B-roll and not so much fun stuff, but... We're gonna go eat again. Eating food again. This place is quite nice. My type of view, check it out. You can catch your own fish, but I think they're all out of fish. It's pretty interesting though. The menu's looking pretty fire. <laughs> what do you think about this view? <laughs> it's looking like my future house. I know, right? That's what I was gonna say. This looks like what we're gonna end up doing. Yeah, totally. Oh, they're actually catching fish out here. Oh, they're gonna eat that thing. Did you order a fish? <laughs> Earthquake. Yeah, if you guys haven't seen the news, I don't know when this video is coming out, but there is a 7.6 magnitude earthquake that hit seven hours away from us. So we barely felt anything. I just, my chandeliers were kind of shaking, but the damage was insane. And I feel really bad for the people who live in that area because it got destroyed. It's yeah. really bad right now. And everyone's reaching out to us asking if we're okay. Yes, we are okay. Japan is pretty big and you know, there's a lot of earthquakes here, but not that big. That doesn't happen very often. Yeah, we're okay. Everyone out there, I, I don't know how things are going. So the prayers out to the families out there. We got our food. First food is grilled rice. Grilled onigiri. Yeah, I guess. I was supposed to put shoyu. Oh, you were? But texture is perfect. Super crispy on the outside, nice and soft on the inside. What is this? This is kadro tempura. Really? No sauce. It is. Do you like the moss? It's so good. Cod eggs. Mm -hmm. Baby eggs. Egg sack. Eggs? Baby eggs? Egg. Anyways, you probably can't see it, but there's little eggs in there. Yummy? So good. Fried oysters. Those look so fire. You know what's more fire? This freaking drink I got with my entire lemon. And there you go, you have a full lemon. Tastes like lemon juice. Just melts in your mouth. We got some clams. Tamagoyaki with kadro. Let's see. 
Mm. So good. Oh my gosh. So good. Can I make this? That's like my favorite dish. They go good together. Wow. <laughs> Insane. And the final dish. And I think it took a while because that fish you guys just saw, I think we're eating it. Maybe it's this guy. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that's what just happened. I think that's what happened. I'm gonna enjoy this last dish and call it a night. And we will see you guys in the morning. Good morning, you guys. We are back at the yard to finish the rest of the stuff you have to do on S15. Current state right now where we left off, we still have to unplug a couple things like the starter alternator wires. I think we'll be able to drop this thing out from the bottom. Today, for the first time ever, we got Coda coming here. Coda's gonna give a hand. He wanted to come pick up some money for the Sylvia, so it worked out. But he should be here any second now. I told him while he's out here, might as well give a hand. <laughs> We'll see how far we get today. Look who's here. Oh, is out of his element right now. He's out of his yard. Welcome. Oh, my snails. Thanks, buddy. <laughs> They're all wondering what the hell. Uh, me and Coda are like really into fish right now. Thanks, man. I got to give you your plants when you come to my house. I got plants for you for your tanks. I gave them their food and they ah! shot so much. Look at how long this is. Oh my gosh. Like just from the morning. We're loving it. <laughs> Rico's freaking <laughs> <That's> zombie. <laughs> Rico's freaking sick. He's trying to touch me. Anyways, we're ready. Gosh. Don't get near that guy, Coda. He's sick. Bringing out the forklift, heavy duty. So apparently we're gonna lift the car up with this once the motor's dropped. Look how big this forklift is, dude. Oh yeah, this is gonna get interesting. Nico's dad actually built this whole thing. I don't know if I mentioned before. This is actually a truck. If you cut it, install a lift on it, a hydraulic pump that opens the gate and this flops down. Pretty cool. All right, what's going on here? I guess we're just checking to see if everything lines up. All right, we should be able to drop everything. She's out. Good job, boys. Dang. That's a good way to do this. Take a whole engine out with the push of a button. There goes my car. <laughs> Where are we putting this thing? That's the question. All right, buddy, you stay here for a bit. It's a cool motor swap for the shed. It's the whole reason Koda came here. He didn't actually come to help. He just came to pick up his cash. <laughs> I got you for S15. Yeah. It's a homie hookup. Get the real deals out yeah, here. Yeah, let's go eat. Yeah, let's not go eat. It's on you? <laughs> not this everyone. looks like a lot. It's actually not that much. It's seven grand. Coda sold me S15 for seven grand so we can go drift in 10 days. How, how good a friend am I? Your brother. Let me know. <laughs> <laughs> the deal was if I can't get my car ready, by the 15th, he's gonna take the car back. So I got yeah. a jam. <laughs> We're almost there though. No, we fine. We already signed the bill of sale, dude. Oh, this looks crazy right now. Oh my gosh. We're dropping the rear subframe onto that. What is that, a paint stand? It should be all right, that little thin piece of wood. Thank God the boys have a forklift here. We'd be screwed without it. We gotta get this subframe unbolted. Like that. Your subframe is completely out, just how we imagined on the go-kart stand. Oh, <laughs> that's scary. Well, at least the chassis is pretty light. Let's go that. Let's go that. We did it. We're freaking 27% done, dude. <laughs> completely ready to drop into another S15. Well, we ended up at the fish store because Kota hasn't been to this one. And as I just mentioned, we're super into fish lately. I gotta show him our local fish store. This thing is huge. You ready to spend some money? <laughs> Dude, they got everything here. Driftwood. This is all used. Everything, look how cheap the tanks are. This tank, 12 bucks. It's insane. Dude, look at this fat tank, 150 bucks. You have like filters, lights, 
That's what you need, Koda. You need a big boy. I, I, I can promise, you know, I can't go any bigger than 60 by 30. Koda already has three tanks. <laughs> <laughs> I've been eyeing this thing out. 250 bucks, that boy tank. Yeah, they used to have a bunch though. It's kind of empty right now. They got some crazy beetles here. Look how big that thing is. Dang, my hands are disgusting. Oh, I think it's cool. Koda's already digging. Oh, this is ADA. All my shit's so, ADA. Homie. Yeah, so ADA, they have they have a museum here in Japan. Yeah. Yes. I need a and guess what? The CO2. They have a fish tank, fully planted fish tank, the size of a house. <laughs> fully planted. Seriously, they have like a freaking tree a in there. Tank. A fish tank as big as a house. <laughs> so people travel to Japan just to see ADA's no museum. Way. Yeah. I want to go. We got to go. They have a whole ADA section over there. And now the fish tank stuff. This shrimp, 75 cents for one shrimp. And this is where I get all my feeders. All the goldfish, guppies. They have a fat saltwater section, but I don't have any salt water. I've been meaning to get into it, but it's a lot of maintenance to do salt water. Mine fish for these guys. Freaking lobster. There's some corals here. Some anemones. Amenemies. That's the reason why I don't want saltwater tanks. Look how dirty this is. Oh, they got crazy animals in here. Look at this. They got this section. What is that? A porcupine. They got one of these guys. Tortoises. Some discus here. They're kind of expensive, like 75 bucks for one. Angelfish. You guys said you wanted fish content. Let's see what they got. It's been holidays, so most of the tanks are pretty empty. Tilapias, earth eaters, some Oscars, some baby Oscars. It's so funny. Datnoid right there. Yep, that's a datnoid. Parrotfish. These guys. More parrotfish. Oh, they got flower horns. Oh, this guy's tied. 75 bucks for him. Jardinis. These are expensive though. 450 bucks. Pufferfish, pretty big. Albino marijuana, some albino pecos. Some cichlids here. Kuna's not into the fish eating live fish type no, fish. No. I like these like slow moving. You're into those? Yeah. Yeah, like, see those the ones I was talking yeah, about? Yeah. They get expensive. But but it's so boring that they don't even move. Yeah. I would rather buy this. That's it's why I like fish that eat other fish. Like, do they have tiger fish here? Oh, yeah. African cichlids. I just bought him yesterday. Oh, Lemon Oscar. Like... I grew him from this small. He's like this big. Man. <laughs> but the shrimps are cool. I, I like the black and white them. ones though. These guys. Wow. Those guys are no. But they're like five bucks for one, dude. I usually put them in the beta tanks, but the betas freaking eat them. <laughs> Look, like tiger fish. These things have fangs, bro. Oh, no more piranhas. I bought all of them. I want him so bad. He's just a little too small. Here's the peacock bass. They got babies, a little bit bigger. I bought one about this big. He's like this big now in a couple months. This guy is pretty dope. Oh, here's the piranhas. Some red bellies. I have 10 of these guys in there. Freaking absolutely savages. <laughs> we gotta do a fish tank update in my house. Holy massive koi fish. Oh my gosh. This tank is too small for you, huh buddy? Jeez, that thing is massive. How cool is this? And it's only 45 bucks. That's crazy. You got some salamanders. Look at these guys. They're only a dollar. Frogs. Oh, that thing looks disgusting. <laughs> Look at these little guys, they're so tight. We got their beta section over here. These are all the females. Got them. Albino arowana. 60 bucks. <laughs> what did you get? Can't even see these little babies. Some koi fish. Are right, you ready, dude? You no. get everything you need? No. No? It's got the line. Shrimp to feed, and then we have the dry shrimp. Fish for my fish. What the hell are you buying? What is this? <laughs> End of my external filter system. I can aim water anywhere. Oh. And slower. The water can... Oh, that's good. We're about to spend like 200 bucks, dude. Don't worry. <laughs> we get joy out of it. Right? It's our second hobby. <laughs> <laughs> and out here, they have a little fish pond where you can pay to catch your own pet fish. 
which is pretty cool. Some koi fish in there. Pretty sick place though. The girls love it. Dakota's gonna order some freaking puffer fish, so I had to vlog this. I brought in some of my local izakaya, and I usually just order off of pictures. But we can read the menu today. I just bought this for fish food. <laughs> <laughs> and now we're eating it. My fish eat good, dude. <laughs> Man. Eating fish after buying fish. Got some fish soup. This is 75 cents for a bowl of soup. You eat it for the broth, but I kind of like digging through the fish. What is this? It looks like duck. It looks like meat to me. That's duck. Oh, it's pork. It's like pork. This is honey miso. Some crab brains. What is this? No, hugusukun. Oh, this is this is puffer fish. This is the puffer fish. Give me some shoyu, bro. It's just like I'm chewing on jello. I don't know. I'll do it so I can say I ate puffer fish. No idea what this is, but fish. It's good. Everything tastes like nothing, Kona. Tastes like crab guts. Yeah, I, I don't like it, dude. <laughs> I don't like it. I swear I just bought these at the fish store. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I bought, dude. That's what I just fed my fish. So my soup came with eyeballs. Every day it's different. There it is. And there's a, I don't know if they call it a pupil. It's good though. Do these things come with pearls, Kona? I don't think so. No pearls in here? <laughs> <laughs> All right, it's the last dish of the night. Flounder fin, that's the Ingoa. Ingoa? Yeah. yeah. That's my favorite. I got the assorted 